Excuse me. Let's take a look around, see what we can find. There you go. We'll be on our way from Little Hope while the others are still MIA in the woods. This place is a real dump even for this shithole town. Something up? Yeah, there's something kind of familiar about this place. You got a big-time criminal past we don't know about? Serial jaywalker? These small-town police stations all look the same. There's gotta be a phone in here someplace. You're deluded if you think there's anything here. Place is dead, just like the rest of Little Hope. I don't want to see. Keep looking.
real nice. Anything else? You know what's it? There's got to be something. We have a winner. Found a phone. This could be our way out. Line's dead. <coughs> Shit! <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Take it easy. Can you stop reacting to every setback like a child? Look here. The cable is missing. Uh, there's got to be a cable here someplace. Don't give up. I feel we're about to find something. What is that? What was that? Scared the fuck out of me, dude. Fucking jumped when I heard that shit, man. What do you think? Answer it. Wait. Let's think about this. Answer the goddamn phone! Hey, come on! Be a man for once in your miserable life! Fine. Hello? Who is this? Who's on the line? I can't tell, but they sound in pretty bad shape. This is getting way too crazy. Just hang up. Do not hang up. This is our best shot at finding out what's going on here. What the f <laughs> I'm 
here, girl. I would speak with you. You cannot talk of our secret. Eternal damnation awaits if you do. We have an understanding, do we not? No evil word shall leave my lips. Should you breathe a word, or the edge of a word about the other things, then I will come to you in the black of some terrible night and bring a reckoning that will shudder you. Now, Reverend, let us begin. Enough time has gone begging. Go be with you, kin. I beseech this court, and good Judge Wyman, do not be fooled by the protestations of the accused. The devil is the master of deceit. All his servants feign innocence. They can do little else. I solemnly swear before God, I am innocent of all accusations against Hush me. Hush now, Amy. What the hell should we do? Let's get the fuck out of here. Not a pair between the two of you. We can't leave this poor woman to face them all alone. I beg you not to abandon me. By all that is holy, with whom are you conversing, woman? Even though I have seen this with my own eyes, I scarcely believe it. Amy is lost to us. Even now, she pleads for evil spirits to remain by her side. You must help me. I beg you. She can hear us. If she can, then maybe others can too. I would ask the court to hear direct testimony. A witness who saw with her own eyes the accused take part in some unspeakable satanic ritual. In the woods, outside of this very town. Reverend Carver, you mislead us all. Forgive me, good judge, but it is my wife who stands accused, and I know her to be innocent. I would not be so quick as to cast stones at others, Joseph. Not when your own conduct does not bear scrutiny. Please hear me, good judge. All accusations against me are false. They're founded only in malice. If there be darkness here among us, I will shine. No! Mary? Mary, my sister, what ails you? What have you done mother? to this child? They you have bound an innocent girl into a pact with the devil himself. The poor oh. creature seems possessed. What no doubt you're doing. It's not true, Reverend. Why have you taken against me so? We will the see the truth of it. Of Amy, lay your hands on Mary. Let us see what occurs. No if I am correct, your no touch no will no release demon. her from this affliction. It must be so if you are the one who bewitched her. Leave her alone! Who speaks? Who's there? God preserve us. Please. The master cannot help you now. It is too late. Here among us, they are here among us. No. What more proof is needed that the devil walks among us in little hole? <laughs> Take heed and pray. The devil is here in this very room. Protect yourselves. Seek out the Lord. What was that shit? Was that for real? Didn't the witch trials happen centuries ago? Most of them over 300 years ago. Then how come we just saw one? Like I say, I have no good explanation. That little girl who had some kind of seizure. What do you think was going on there? I know that little girl. She's the one me and Angela saw back in the woods. That woman, my double? What's she looking at if the trial goes against her? The sentence for confirmed witches in Little Hope was always brutal. Violent death, drowning, hanging, burning. And let's hope she is, or was, found innocent. Accusations were often malicious, made by someone with a grudge or by meddling liars. 
like that little girl, who took perverse pleasure in poisoning their own communities. I'm with you. That kid knew exactly what she was doing when she dropped Angela 2.0 deep in the shit. That woman, my double, was very distressed, almost traumatized. Yeah. It was tough to watch, for sure. I noticed something else weird. Her husband? He looked a lot like you, Professor. The two people with that little brat look just like Daniel and Taylor. What the hell does all this mean? Who's that? Hey, Professor! You in there? Come on, let's go. Hey, Taylor! We're in here! We can't open the damn doors! Uh, we can't either! They must be locked. Let's all try to force the handle. In three, two, one... Taylor. Hey, Professor. Find anything that could get us out of here? Nah, big fat nothing back there. Just a pile of junk. Still think splitting <clears throat> up was a smart move? I would say I'm now more open to exploring other options. I'm glad you two are finding this funny. Personally, I think we're in deep shit here. You know what happened to your double, right? She was accused of witchcraft. Not just accused. Tried, found guilty, and condemned. We need to know what that woman is facing. What's gonna happen to her next? I like the idea. But how would we even begin to find that out? We've already been down those paths. Maybe the answer lies down the one path we haven't taken yet. What the hell? This is fucking crazy. We have no clue what we're getting ourselves into. The trial, the strange girl, Angela's double. Feels like it's all building towards something. Only question is, are we headed someplace good or bad? And bad is probably very, very bad. Fog is getting worse. Maybe the fog was the reason for the diversion. We were never meant to make it out of here. See for shit. Jesus. The water looks black. I don't want to go anywhere near it. Okay. Who's first up? Huh. Professor? You keep telling us you're in charge, so... Maybe we need to check all our other options first. Right. Thought so. Come on.
I want off this bridge as fast as possible. But not that fast. Someone has to go first. You lead. I'll be right behind you. Can't stay here. In this year of our Lord, sixteen hundred and ninety two, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No, Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I have done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. What's going on? Why, why do you look like Angela? Your words have little meaning to me, but I beg you. Help me. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, let us conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. You cannot do this! But Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he come for us all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poisoned from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. In Little Hope, he has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by accuser. While Mary still draws breath, little hope remains beyond salvation. There lies your evil reference to your very fix. Isaac. What did you see? Tell me. I don't know how to tell you what I just saw. Give us a moment here, will ya? We've just gone through something pretty tough. Tough in what way? I need a moment. I'll go first. <clears throat> okay, you two, get on down here.
What the hell is that? What is that thing? Get away from it! Run! Get the hell out of there! Look out! Shit! Don't leave me behind! Hey! Give me a hand here! Hold on, hold on! Oh, shit. I'm coming back for you, John. Hold on. Reach up and grab my hand. Jump up and grab onto me. Okay, I trust you. Phew, that was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. Well done. Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. Andrew had a gun. How could you have let something so precious be lost like that? Given where it went and what came out of there, I suppose we can consider it lost forever. The boys have some interesting theories. Maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood with that sour ferryman, which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> it's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out, hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? <laughs> okay then, we will once again turn to the Bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act five, scene one, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. Wait! What in the name of holy fuck was that? I've never seen anything like it. It was like something from a nightmare. Did you see the way it looked? The gaping mouth, those dead, soulless eyes? Whatever it was, it's gone now. I was nearly gone. If that thing had caught me, 
It was so close. You've had the crap scared out of you. We all have. But at least we got the fuck away from it. You saying I should be grateful? That I owe you for my life? No, chill. I I'm saying it all happened so happen. fast, it's a good thing we all made it. Oh. <sighs> Angela, what's up? What's going on? My legs felt like they were on fire. You okay? <sighs> Must be payback for all the climbing I did. You are going to tell me right now what happened to my double on that bridge. We need to focus on what we're doing now, not on what's already behind us. You two the Brotherhood of Silence now? The poor fragile woman can't take it? Either of you see what happened to Taylor and Daniel? They can't be far behind us. Let's just get out of here. Can we keep moving? I don't feel safe here. Thing is still coming for me. It doesn't sound close. We'll be fine if we keep moving. I really hope you're right. Let's stay away from that bridge. I'm all for putting as much distance between us and that hideous thing as we can. Pretty sure Daniel and Taylor would be thinking the same thing. Out of sight, quick! to keep out of his way, I reckon. 
That woman's final words keep buzzing in my head. To end what's happening in Little Hope, the little girl has to be stopped. Was she warning you or the people who were with her? I couldn't tell. Come on, let's go. I'll go in and take a look around. How you doing? How am I holding up? Let's see, a radioactive mutant gargoyle tried to scarf down our classmates. Our leader, the professor, has turned into a boy scout. We're stuck in a creepy little shithole town with fuck you up fog. And there are way out of date wackos talking witchy bullshit all over. <sighs> I'm real good. How about you? Truth be told, I'm still shaken up a little from the crash. <sighs> How could I forget? We were in a bus wreck too. Get better and better. What's that noise? Didn't hear anything. I don't like this. I want to go another way. Don't think there is another way. Quite the tourist trail. Not a place I want to revisit. Hey, over here. You gotta check this out. That thing could still be around here. In the water. No, we left that thing way behind. We must have. Oh, shit. You're going first, right? You weigh half what I do. Better if you lead. I'm not crossing this crapped out bridge, no way. To find the others we gotta cross. We got no choice. Fine. I'm heading across, you can follow me. If the bridge is still standing. Okay then. You see this? Let's get out of here. Daniel! Get your hands off us! Quiet.
That little kid is the evil here? I don't, I don't get it. My beloved Amy proclaimed it so with her dying testimony. If this evil is to end, Mary must be stopped. Who in the hell are you? Why do you look just like John? I have no answers for you. Perhaps I'm already under a witch's spell. There it lies. I found it. How did you come by this? Fashioned with my own hand. I take it to protect you. Suspicion and betrayal walk side by side in Little Oak. No one is safe. Please, Tabitha, let me keep it! Nothing. No working phone anywhere. Okay, so it looks like we really are trapped here. Still no sign of them? Nope. Not yet. I just hope they're both okay. I figured we'd have found the bus driver by now. Wonder where he's at. Why can't you leave us alone? I... I think she wants us to go after her. I'm with you. We go after her. She's mixed up in all this. The two girls we've seen. One is from the past. This one is from here and now. Maybe the girl we're seeing here is somehow a mirror image of the girl from the 17th century. Don't you want to wait for Daniel and Taylor? If they were coming this way, they'd be here by now. <laughs> Stay loose. Who knows what's up ahead? <sighs> hey, wait for us! Angela, shit, no! 
What did she do to deserve that? It's just you and me now. Until Taylor and Daniel get to us. Hey! There's something blocking the door. Give me a hand, will ya? This place is a museum of some kind. She in there? Relax. This doesn't feel right. Stay focused. We're not having a rerun of what just happened to Angela. You sure about that? I'll do whatever it takes to keep us both safe. Once we're out of here, we'll hook up with the others. That's if they're still alive. Why is this kid out here on her own? It's strange. Maybe she's linked to Mary somehow? Gotta be. Though how and why, I'm not sure of yet. Disturbing. They creep the hell out of me. Thing felt so real, like we were right there. This is what the trial was all about. People being in cahoots with the devil. Right. And this kid, Mary, who snitched on everyone. That's gotta be the girl we're seeing.
Hey, take a look at this. I've seen this before. Where? On the road outside that shitty little bar we stopped at. Angela and me saw it laying there, picked it up. Right before that kid Mary scared us for the first time. Interesting. You think she maybe let us here? Wanted us to see this? Let's take a proper look. What the hell, Professor? There are many, many stories about how spirits can attach themselves to objects. Sure, in movies. Take it easy, will you? What if Mary's spirit is somehow attached to this thing? We burn it, and this could all end right here. Look at it another way. Maybe by burning her precious things, it's just gonna piss the kid off. You might be right. This is the same trial we saw back in the police station. Disturbing me alike. Get out this way. Where'd that little girl get to? She let us in here and then disappeared. Maybe that was her plan all along. Lead us to the puppet. Job done. I'm not sure about that. Almost out of juice. No signal out here anyway. You hear that? Maybe. Heard something, not sure what. Guys? Professor? That you in there? Can we just get out of here? Where the hell are the others? Probably as lost as us. You think they're looking for us? Could be. Angela's got no interest in finding me. That's for sure. She's got a mean streak, all right. But she's got some heart. <laughs> you sure about that? Yeah. Known her for a long time. Longer than any of you. She's been through some real shit. But she's still got a soft side. <sighs> All right. Ten bucks says no one's home. I'm not touching that. Still, first place we've seen in a while. Find a way in? Like you found a way into that store? 
You a burglar in your spare time? <laughs> no. But I was in a past life. Not getting through this way. Hey, Taylor, check this out. Check what out? Don't think anyone's visited for a long time. Oh, yeah. And that's ten bucks you owe me. Don't owe you squat. I never took the bet. Fair enough. It's loose. I can jimmy this open, no problem. We could have a big powwow about who goes in first. But we both know what's gonna happen. Right. Sure thing. What? Oh, Easy shit. now, tough guy. Don't beat up the scary doll. Funny. Get your ass in here. Come on. This way. These things look so real. They're freaking me out. What's up? I just... I just saw something. Where the hell are you going? You sure this is a good move? Nope. That you? Taylor? I'm not completely your boss. Cast aside your false idol and pray to the one almighty Lord for forgiveness. Taylor! You okay? What's going on? What happened? I heard voices. I saw my fucking self looking back at me, dressed all weird, speaking funny. I mean, what the fuck? I'm 
Sorry I wasn't there for you. I... This woman, the one who looked like me, they just dragged her out like some kind of criminal. I mean, shit. Let's get out of here. I hear that. Found a knife. Maybe it was a knife once, when dinosaurs roamed the earth. Think we should bring it along? Here, you take it. Uh, why? It's obvious, dummy. Self-defense. You take it. You know, just in case. Hey, check this out. The enclosed poppet, or doll, is thought to have originally belonged to a child in the late 1600s. Creepy. Shit, wait, I got it. This missing doll has got to be the one I saw with the kid. You think? That's kind of weird. Kinda weird? This place is full on nightmare central. I don't want to stay here any longer than I have to. With you on that. Come on, this way up.
Are things becoming any clearer for you? That thing, whatever it is, just keeps coming for Angela. Unrelenting. I do hope she's okay. Now, at last, someone has a weapon. Shall we try to hold on to this one? Let me help you out. Give you one little hint. Well then, how can I put this? We each have our own demons. They are ours and ours alone, and they are often born out of regret. <sighs> I'll leave you now with some wise words from a great Irish playwright I once met in uh, Paris, I believe. <clears throat> Never judge anyone shortly. Every saint has a past and every sinner has a future. She's just a child. Let's speak again later. Looks like we've locked out here. Back on the road. The professor and the others can't be far. Hope you're right. We've been shit out of luck so far tonight. The woman who looks like me... What did she do to be taken like that? Not a great omen for sure, but nothing's gonna happen to you. I'll make sure of that. <sighs> Even the writers here don't have happy endings. Sure looks that way. What I saw back there was unreal. I get that, but... But shit, this whole night has been messed up since we crashed. Thanks for having my back. This shitty night would be a lot tougher without you here. We've looked out for each other. Where the hell is that coming from? I don't know.
Get over here! This is impossible. I know those markings. This is my old tire swing. Look, here, see? Hey, hey, it's okay, it's okay. It's not okay, you don't get it. See these stars? I painted them onto this tire with my dad when I was 10 years old. You sure? Hell yes, I'm sure this is my tire swing. How come it's out here? Can't be, just looks the same. It's just a coincidence. Can you listen to what I'm saying here? This town knows me. Hey, hey, look at me, look at me. We're getting through this, okay? Together. This is not my doing. You must help me, I beg you. Please help me before it is too late. Hush now, woman. Only the Almighty can forgive your sin. That is your only hope of salvation. Listen to me. I have committed no sin. The puppet I am condemned for is a child's plaything. Nothing more. I swear it. Do not swear it. me. The sickness you brought into our midst must be purged. To free all of us and you from evil. You must burn. I beg you, stop. Do not do this. No, no, please, stop. Stop. Pray Lord for you to take the soul of this our sister Tabitha, who has been led astray by the devil, and do with it as you will. Nothing bad's gonna happen to you. I'll make sure of that. Thanks. I'm glad you're here. <laughs> 